So the Musa and pricing plans are pretty straightforward and we're gonna walk you through what you get with each of them along with some of the main core features. Now, before we begin, I actually put a link down below or if you wanna click that, you can follow along with me or either get a free plan because Musa does come with a free plan, which I'm gonna start off right now. So it's gonna be free forever and you get all the core features, which are a lot of them, which I'll walk you through as well, but you do get unlimited emails, you get sign up and subscription forms along with reporting and analytics. Okay, so you can send unlimited emails, which is cool. The reason this would change is if you happen to get a specific amount of subscribers, which I will get to. Now, if we compare the plans, you'll see right here with the free, you get a lot of cool things like email campaigns, pop up forms, inline forms in terms of branding, all of these are going to be the same regarding you know, which uh, plan you choose. Same thing with marketing automation right here. Tracking, you do get to track a lot of things, whether it's page visits, opens and clicks, bounces, unsubscribes and complaints. Everything is going to be the same for all of the plans. Now, when we move on to reporting and insights, you're pretty much getting almost everything except from custom reporting, which is only for the enterprise. Support, this will be knowledge base, email and chat for the free. As you move on, you get phone support and as you move on the enterprise, you get much more than that, even like onboarding and migration. Then of course, when it comes to integrations and connectivity, you get 100 plus integrations and API access. Now keep in mind, I was mostly describing the free. As I talked about before, these are gonna increase and get better as you move up in these specific plans. Now. When we move on to the pro, it's gonna start off at $10 monthly. The great thing about this, the bigger upgrades, not only are you getting the core features that I previously talked about, you're getting access to landing pages, transactional emails, phone support, and then SMTP server, okay? So the pricings are actually gonna change based upon how many subscribers you need. So starting with monthly, uh, if you move this on up, it's gonna to go to, I think, $20 monthly. There we go. So around 2,500 is going to be 20. And then you got, I'm not gonna stop it exactly because it usually stops around the 4,500 and I gotta keep dragging my mouse. But as you can see, I move up 5,500, it's only gonna be 40. Then we have around 8,500 for 55. Then we have 10,500 for 125. And you'll see as I move it up, you know, 24, let's see, I think it's 25.5. Yep, it's gonna be 205, moving it up more. Okay, just dragging a little bit more. Obviously, as you get up higher, it's going to be more, but also they do have the annual plan, so if you wanna save money, you would just click on that. You can pretty much see the difference of what it would be between monthly and annual. I usually recommend that if you're gonna be using a tool for the long term, I always go with annual just because it saves me so much money, and it makes sense if you're gonna be using for a longer period of time because I personally like saving money when I use software, okay? Aside from that, there's also going to be the enterprise plan. Now, this doesn't have a specific price tag to it because as it says right here, aside from the fact that you'll get all you'll ever need, you're gonna to have to get a custom plan but when it comes to this, the upgraded perks are going to be custom reporting, account manager, SSO and SAML, onboarding and migration, and of course, service level agreement. So that's going to be price specific. You would just you know click here and talk to support based on that. So the price is pretty much going to change mostly for the pro plan, You know, as you can see in here. It's really gonna depend on how many subscribers you need. Uh, and given the fact that Musen has some great prices, whether you're getting started, you only have a few subscribers, you know, up to, I think it's 2,500 it changes. So you can have 2,000 subscribers. It's only going to be $10 monthly, which is not a lot of money. That's a really good pricing for an email marketing tool. Plus you get landing pages with that, transactional emails and so on and so forth, okay? And there's actually one more option, which is going to be right here, where if you do looking for credits, you can click on that. And if you scroll down, it's gonna be one credit equals 1,000 emails, okay? Who knew credits would be so powerful? Spend as you send and keep the rest for your next campaign. No strings attached. And uh, same, same, but different. It says credits are just as mighty as their pro plan. Same features, same professional services right when you want them. Okay, so that's another option when it comes to Moosend. But that pretty much highlights everything when it comes to the pricing, a lot of their big features, and of course, how much you'd be looking to invest when it comes to a plan like this. If I drag this all the way down to zero subscribers, you'll see that it's going to be free. And this is just going to change based upon, you know, how many subscribers you need. And of course, if you want a custom plan, that's what the enterprise plan is going to be. So I hope this helped you out when it comes to a quick overview of the Moosen prices. Once again, I'll put a link down below. We always get a free account, try them, see just how much you like them. And then of course, decide if they're going to be perfect for you. That's about it. Thank you for watching and have an amusing day.